Hey everyone, Brian Poss here, and today we're here to talk about my favorite thing, private equities. We're going to go over five tips to get you started with private equity investing. So what I love about private equity investing is there's a lot of power in private equity investing. When you look at the stock market, you look at some of the stocks right now, everything is so overvalued. These PE ratios are just off the chart. With private equities, it's not the case. You can get in early and you can find good deals. And then what I also love about it too is even if you have a small account, so millennials, Gen Xers, Gen Zers, this is a great opportunity to get invested in some early startup companies that have a lot of potential on the upside. So let's get into the five tips. So tip number one, invest in something that you're familiar with or an industry that you've worked in or that you know somewhat. When you look at Warren Buffett and you see some of the stocks and the investments that he's done, he only invests in things that he knows. He doesn't know technology very well, so he rarely invests in technology stocks. Same thing with private equities. Invest in something that you know. For me, it's technology. I know technology well, I've worked in this space, and I love technology, it's my passion. So that's what I choose to invest in. Tip number two, you wanna pick something early stage. Early stage is the best time to get in because it offers the most potential for the upside in terms of profits, growth, valuation for the company. When you look at this chart and you compare the private valuations compared to the public valuations, you can see which ones have the most potential for the most opportunity for growth. Tip number three, pick a site to find PE deals. Like I mentioned in a previous video, there's sites like WeFunder, MicroVentures, OurCrowd. These sites have lots of deals with lots of companies on there looking for people to invest early stage. So pick one of those sites, go on there, set up an account, and start investing. What's great about these sites is technology's evolved, so you don't have to be an accredited investor to invest in private equities anymore. That wasn't the case years ago. Tip number four, due diligence. It's all about due diligence. You have to research these companies, you have to look at those financials. In part two of our video, we'll dive into that a little bit more, but that's a crucial step. You have to understand what you're investing in so that you make the right choice. Tip number five, and the final tip, is you have to open a new view account. Your money doesn't do very good sitting on the sidelines. So open a new view account and you can start investing in private equities today. So those are my tips to get you going with private equity investing. So if you're ready today, I encourage you to reach out to an IRA specialist or go to newviewtrust.com and open an account. Stay tuned for part two of our private equity series where we're gonna dive into some of these sites and I'm gonna walk you through how you do due diligence and how you can actually invest in some of these private equity deals.